Hey, you okay? Keep it together, man. You're quite virtuous, however, to be concerned about someone other than yourself, given our present circumstances. I'm going to reward you with an oil field. An oil field? Ah, my usual habit. <laughs> Everyone dies eventually. Dying sooner, at least, saves you some pain, right? Nice to see you here, and welcome to the confessional. Who are you? This is the world of nightmares. I guess you could call me its supervisor. I sense a force of change rising up. What exactly happened in the other world? I guess it doesn't matter. You lambs are all destined to die here anyway. What? Are you ridiculous? But before I kill you, I want to determine the value of your life. So you'll have to answer some questions. Question one. What expectations do you have for your significant other? Pull the rope with the answer that best matches your true feelings. Supervisor, someone else brought you here. It's someone you know. <sighs> you never know what people are actually thinking. To learn the truth, you must survive. Then you can think about what's going on here. Let's head to the next trial. There's still more? Commencing Area 2. Are you ready? <laughs> Alright, I got it. Alright, I got it. Are you getting the hang of this? How the fuck am I supposed to get the hang of this? Hey, don't run off my head! Help me! Sorry, man, but I'm not going to die helping you. I've got to... Oh, yeah. As you climb, you'll run into strange items. Strange items? Yeah, I don't know what you're talking about. I'll try to remember it for later. You can only carry one item at a time, but each one has a very useful purpose. Don't worry about using an item at the wrong time. If you regret it, you can always undo. When you use a white block, a 3x3 platform will appear at your feet. This enables you to create footing even in tight spaces. Alright, I got it! How's this? Edge. Alright, I got it! Alright, I got it! Edge. 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 Edge.
this. It's ringing. I'm gonna get out of here. How's this? If you can't find a way forward, you may wish to undo, undo. and try a new strategy. Undo. Undo. <laughs> Edge. All right, I got it. Let me use this. others here and there. The fighting's gonna start getting fierce. This is a dog-eat-dog -dog world. There's no time for courtesy. Anyway, no matter what pops up, stay calm. What the hell is this place? How high does this damn thing go? I don't know. I wish I did. You got it. Got it. How's this? I'll take this. Undo. If you can't find a way forward, you may wish to undo and try a new strategy. It's you. Looks like you're still alive. Is that you? You're safe too. Barely. Still. How many people died trying to come here? People? I don't... Listen. Here, you see everybody else as sheep. But all these sheep? They're really human. There's got to be some reason why we were all brought here. What reason could there be? Why do we have to suffer like this? Who knows? But... I do have an idea. An idea? Let's stop the speculation. It's just going to confuse us more. <sighs> you should think of what to do next. I'm hearing rumors of something big coming soon. You be careful now. Something big? Still, you're really getting the hang of things. There's nothing more I can teach you. That can't be true. Come on, you gotta have something you can tell me. If we're lucky, we'll meet again. <sighs> hey, wait! You can learn tips on how to climb. Moving blocks around mindlessly won't work. Try to pick up some useful techniques. New techniques will be written down by the other sheep. as the number of steps you mean to climb up. You'll have the support you need to reach higher and higher, like a pyramid. Pull out two blocks vertically. 
then slide the bottom one over. Since edges connect, you can make a stairway, even in tight spots. I found this out just now. Yo, have we met before? You survived because of the techniques I found, huh? Tell me something. Let me show you another great technique. Allow me to explain suspending. This technique gives you more room to maneuver. Push a block off a ledge with nothing below it. As long as the edges connect, the block will remain in place. How's that? I'm a regular blockologist, huh? <laughs> hmm, that's a good start. Try to remember this one, too. Allow me to explain pullback. If you climb up and find yourself stuck, try pulling a block and backing down. By creating a stairway as you go down, you will be able to go higher than you could before. That's crazy. You knew that? Um, well... Okay, you find any new moves, you come straight to me. This is coming from an executive manager. I'll write down any techniques I discover. I recommend reading them from time to time. The hell? Hmm? What do you want? No, nothing. Let's make it out alive. I'm not sure how I feel about being encouraged by a sheep. But I guess it's better than being a chef. Or even worse, a kitchen hand. Huh? What's a kitchen? I said pay attention. Huh. Sorry. <sighs> kitchen band. Next question. What do you value? I've had enough of this. A man's worth can't be measured by a single question. Not to mention, you have more than one path ahead of you. <laughs> this is the second question. Does life begin or end with marriage? <laughs> You've made your selection. I knew it! This is actually a giant chapel with eight floors. Wait, does that mean there's an end to this? The world is in a state of flux. I won't be able to guarantee what your future holds. Be careful what you take for granted. I'm sure you've heard the stories of people losing such things. Something big is coming. I can feel it. Something the likes of which this world has never seen. I guess there's no point in worrying about the future. You have more pressing matters to attend to. <laughs> Are you ready? I don't like that laugh. So what the hell's going on here? Won't escape. Huh? What? That voice. Where have I? I won't escape. What the hell is this? Catherine? The fists of Grudge have right, appeared. It. It's the killer. Do not die. If 
you're stuck, it would be best to try and undo it. <laughs> Undo, undo, undo. Edge, edge. Edge, edge. Edge. Did you think you could escape? Edge. Alright, you got it. Yay! Yeah. Yeah. you use a bell? All nearby blocks will be converted into normal white blocks. This is handy for getting rid of tricky obstacles, such as cracked blocks or immovable blocks.
got it. Like this. Safe, right? Yeah! Congratulations. Amazing climbing. The prison of despair could not hold you. As promised, I have something special to show you tonight. Think back to long ago. Back to a time when you felt happy. Sorry about today. I don't usually burn the bacon like that. That's all right. I don't mind it a little crispy. I can tell something's going on with you. You working too hard? <laughs> no, I'm fine. <laughs> You've been gaining weight, haven't you? Can't forget to eat your veggies. Well, I put ketchup on almost everything. <laughs> that doesn't count. You know what? <laughs> <laughs> Maybe a little workout will burn out those extra calories. <laughs> <laughs> what do you think? Fond memories, huh? You should think long and hard about what you have to lose. Let's do this again tomorrow. If you can survive, that is. is just a tradition, right? Seriously, who wants to be tied down? As long as two people are together, it's okay, right? It's supposed to be free, don't you think? Kind of surprising. Hmm? You know how it is with most girls. As soon as they're adults, all they can think about is tying the knot, right? But there are girls like you out there. <laughs> Never knew. Oh, it's not that strange, is it? Men aren't the only ones who fear being chained down. I'll remember that. Thank goodness. Huh? We think alike. Oh! to work tomorrow, so I need to get home. Oh, oh. I had fun tonight. Oh, oh. You must like what you see. <laughs> I'm not staring. You're a bad liar. You taste like smoke, <laughs> but I don't mind. <laughs> you don't say. Oh man, this is not good. Hmm? 
what isn't good? Well, uh, you know, hooking up after we just met. Jeez, what the hell am I saying? Hmm. Huh? Um, is this gonna be a problem? So, okay, I cheated on Catherine. This is bad. This is really, really bad. But I didn't make a move. She forced herself on me. Oh, fuck, man. I drank way too much. Ha <laughs> Uh, would you mind not staring at me like that? It's kind of creepy. Oh. <laughs> Sorry. Listen, I don't want you to get the wrong idea, okay? I don't just sleep around. I came here because I like you. Huh? Oh. No. no. So, how do you feel about me? Huh? Oh. Wow. Um, I can't quite explain it. Uh, I feel odd. Hmm? You see, this is my first time. Oh, wow. I can't believe it. And I am really screwing this up right now. So then, it was love at first sight? Huh? Ah! What? I'm sorry. I'm really... You said you have to work, right? Work? Uh, I guess? Sorry. I, uh, I gotta go now. I have a, um, a dentist appointment now. Dentist? Yeah. Dentists get angry if you're late, too. Oh, I wanted to stay with you a little longer. I guess they'll have to wait until next time. <laughs> okay, see you soon. Hey, wait! I'm actually dating someone already. Oh, this is a mistake. A mistake. It's gotta be a mistake. Ah, you know what? It just hit me. You know how they say every guy has three hot streaks with the ladies in his life? This is your third. Hot streaks? When the hell were the other two? When we were kids, you're the most popular with the girls. <laughs> I don't remember that. The second time you were in the zone was when you started dating Catherine. Although, uh, that's over if she finds out about this. Oh, crap, man. She's probably gonna kill me. That's what you're all scared about. As long as she doesn't find out, you're safe, right? Just act like it never happened. I'm not like you. I can't just ignore this. Well then, why not switch it up? That way you won't hear any more marriage talk, right? All that stuff about soulmates and eternal love is bullshit. Married life sucks, man. You really want to go through the same shit I have? I'm not like you. I don't want to sleep around. I just want life to stay the same. <sighs> what am I gonna do? I didn't mean for any of this to happen. If you're gonna whine, you shouldn't have done it, dumbass. Well, no shit. I wish I could just live all carefree like you. Don't you realize there's nothing you can do, you schmuck? No matter how good you are to a woman, you never know if she'll stab you in the back. <sighs> well, if you're gonna ditch the new girl, hook me up. She's cute, right? You got a picture of her? Nice. No, I don't have her pic. She's not your type, anyway. Come on, how do you know that? Because she's my type. Oh. <sighs> Damn, I am so fucked. Hey, have you heard the rumor about the dream where you're falling? Huh? Who cares? Come on, if you fall and die in the dream, you'll die in real life. My friend's boyfriend almost died. Isn't that scary? Huh? How do you know? Were you able to see his dream? Hey, you all right, man? You don't look so hot. Uh, I guess I didn't really get much sleep last night. Obviously. Anyway, you're way too freaked out over a one-night stand. Hey, you paying attention? Listen, man. Huh. I never saw the girl. Oh, really? I figured one of you guys told her to sit with me. 
Uh, if this girl was cute, he'd definitely remember. You know, I gotta say, because of you jerks, I never get a chance to date anyone. If I was a ladies' man, I wouldn't be here every night with you guys. Anyway, you dig the older chicks, don't you? Yeah, I want a woman who's, you know, mature, stern, has a nice pair of heels. Whoa, man. I like that creepy guy in horror movies who tries too hard to be noticed. Shut up! I'm not like that! What's wrong with, you know, having some adult fun with someone older than I am? Hmm. So, did I hear someone call for me? Oh, hey, Erica! I've got a nice pair of stiletto heels I know how to use. Oh, Erica. Okay, enough of that. So have you guys heard about the woman's wrath? They say it targets cheating men and kills them. Or not. Which is it? Wait, 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 what? What exactly is this woman's wrath? Oh, you don't need to worry about it. You only care about your girl, Vincent. Oh, what are you talking about? This guy totally needs to know. Cheating is pathetic. I agree with Toby. Pathetic. Who are you calling pathetic? Shut up and eat your peanuts. Oh, my eye! Huh? What? You're cheating. Weren't you talking about marriage? Why don't you say it louder? Seriously, stop yelling about cheating and shit. I, I think someone on Mars didn't quite hear you. Oh, that's low, Vincent. Lowest of the low. Don't call me that. Now you know. Let's just leave me alone. Well, well, come on, tell me about this girl. Oh, God. Apparently, she's destiny level cute. Cut that shit out. Are you kidding? Finding your soulmate is awesome. I'm totally jealous. You jackasses better not mention this to anyone outside the bar. I am serious. Dude, we know the drill. Say, have you heard? It seems that Boss was a bit of a player back in the day and broke more than his share of hearts. You see how he's wearing those tacky sunglasses indoors? They say he's using those to hide his face. <laughs> yeah, right. You're in hot water yourself, right? Maybe you should invest in some shades. Ha, ha, ha. Shut up. I'm done fooling around. Oh, by the way, Rin's gonna play the piano here, starting today. That? Okay. Hello. Do you know where you are? Okay. Never mind that. Uh, how about a name? Uh, uh, Rin. Rin? Uh, that's a nice name. Uh, who is that, though? What's that? Amateur hour. Oh, don't say that. Rin's working really hard. Uh, Vincent? What did you think of my performance? Oh, it was, uh, great. Yeah, it was great. Really, uh, unique. Thank you so much. I was hoping to play a little better than that, but... Don't worry about it. No one gets things perfect the first time around. I guess you're right. I'll have to keep practicing. Yeah, if the bar doesn't go out of business by then. God! Well, I'll see you later. See ya. <laughs> well, nobody's perfect. I mean, <laughs> if she's that cute, who cares, right? <laughs> What's up with you anyway? Saving some cute girl from a stalker in the streets? 
Sounds like a daytime soap opera. That stuff doesn't really happen. Well, it did, so give it a rest. Does that girl really have amnesia? Erica, you took her to the doctor, right? Did they find anything? Not really. They think it's only temporary. But it must be hard when the only thing you remember is wanting to play piano. Hey, so are you two really neighbors now? Yeah, the uh, last guy just happened to move out. You better keep your hands off her. Oh, shut up. It's not like that. I, I'm an old man over here. But you guys really came through for us. You know it. Having Rin work here was a great idea, huh? We have you guys and even a police officer as customers. Not to mention, public spaces are a lot safer if she's really being stalked by someone. Yeah. Spend some time at the bar. You can drink by pressing the square button or get up by pressing the circle button. You can open menus with the options button. You can change the puzzle type and difficulty of the game and config. your intoxication level up to three times. How drunk Vincent gets corresponds to how fast he moves that night in his nightmare. Shit, I've never cheated in my life before. <sighs> Cheating, huh? It's not like I can just apologize for it and everything will be fine. But here is some trivia for you, as you seem to have finished your glass. Rum is made from the sugar cane grown in the Caribbean. Other popular cocktails that feature rum include the Mai Tai, the Mojito, and the Pina Colada. How about pairing a nice cocktail with a juicy steak? That was the cocktail trivia for tonight. Empty already? Hey, can I get a drink? Understood. Here you go. Uh-oh. Uh, Ren, I didn't order wine. It looks really expensive. Full-bodied stuff? I know this is subtle, but here is some trivia about wine for those who are enjoying Catherine, full body. Unlike white wine, red wine isn't categorized as sweet or dry. To express the richness of a red wine, it is described by likening it to the shape of a woman's body. Light, medium, and full. Hmm. I wonder what a full body looks like. And that was the trivia for tonight. Please enjoy a variety of alcoholic drinks and learn more trivia facts. Rin, that wine is for another customer. Oh? Sorry, I made a mistake. Well, don't worry about it. But please let me know if there's anything else you'd like to order. What would you like to order? I'll try sake. Sake, please. I'll take a beer. Beer. Okay. Thank you for waiting. Cursed? 
Apparently, it's related to those mysterious deaths. You mean, like how Paul died? Yeah, or it is. This is getting called the woman's wrath. <laughs> Sounds like something Erica would like to have. Hey, Paul's been here a few times, right? Yeah, he was a classmate of ours back in high school. I ran into him just the other day. Seriously? How was he? We just traded greetings, but he looked fine. Maybe I should have paid more attention. Hey, it's not your fault, man. Hmm? Yeah, I guess. <laughs> Accept it as a one-time screw. Whew. I'm glad Rin's doing okay, but her performance is still... Well... Whew. I know this is sudden, but here is some trivia about sake for you. Daiginjo and Honjozo are two of the many varieties of sake a brand produces. Do you know what differentiates one type from another? The differences in the varieties of sake can be attributed to the degree of polishing the rice undergoes during the brewing process. The Ginjo contains the highest amount of polished rice, followed by Ginjo and Honjozo. Junmai is produced without using brewer's alcohol. Compared to the average polishing ratio of 90%, a minimum of 50% of the rice must be polished away to classify a sake as daiginjo. So much is forsaken to acquire such an exquisite taste. Be sure to drink every last drop. And that was the sake trivia for tonight. Empty already? You still want a drink? No, I'm cool. play piano is so specific. I wonder if there's a reason. I'll let you know if she remembers anything. All right, see ya. It's just... My mother's been calling me up and asking how we're doing. Why, you don't want to marry your girlfriend? I don't just sleep around. Um, Vincent? What did you think of my performance? of the deadly climb begins here. Trap blocks activate when you step on them. Don't stop on top of them. Ah, oh, damn it. Again? How long is this gonna go on? It's been every night now. Alright, I got 
Using a Bible, you can eliminate those who stand in your way. That way, no one can block your path. to try and undo your moves. Can't die here. Like that. Wait, aren't I just a sheep to you? A sheep? 
What do you mean? Come to think of it, you're not a sheep either. What's going on? There's no time for that. This place is bad. If you don't get out of here, you're gonna die. Die? I see. So that's why everyone's so scared. In that case... I'm telling you, this is no time for piano! Playing music calms my heart, even in a place like this. I'd like to share that feeling with everyone else. That's so. That's right. I heard it earlier, and then... And then the ground stopped crumbling. Was that... because of Rin's playing? <laughs>